Breast cancer just doesn't affect women because Angie on Facebook has said, it's a great idea, we love it, of course. I hope the same is going to be done for men. And Claire said, great idea, but don't forget that men get breast cancer too. Quite right to tell us that, of course. So we thought... Absolutely. You know, I was thinking to myself, and I remember we were talking about this, and I said, well, if you're a man, do you check in the same way? Yep, it's similar. We'll show in a minute how to do this. But, right. you know, 400 men in this country will get breast cancer every year and they tend to get it at a more advanced stage because they're not looking for it like right, women are of course. so much. Also, about 50% of teenage boys will get some enlargement of their breast tissue under their nipple as they go through puberty. OK. OK, it's a normal thing. Okay. It, it resolves on its own. But men have breast tissue too, mm. usually focused under the nipple, and they should check okay. on, on a regular basis, just like women do. Well, well let's do that very thing, Billy Let's call Jones. in Jonathan, Absolutely. because he I is here at our disposal. Where is Jonathan? Here Hi, he Jonathan. is, the man Good. himself. Thank so you for doing this. Like, we'll talk you through. Anytime. So any guy who's in the, in the habit of checking their testicles, which is more for important, sure. should yeah, also include the breast tissue. It doesn't okay. take very long at all. So you might be in the shower, you might be in the bath, you've got a bit of soap on you, you can slide the fingers around. Yeah. That's easy. <laughs> or if you're not in the shower, you can do this. You're looking in the mirror now, OK? You're looking in the mirror. Look for any asymmetry of the breasts. Anything, has anything changed since last time? Look at the nipple. Is there any rash around the nipple? Mm -hmm. Is there any discharge? Anything that you've not noticed before? So you've done the visual inspection. OK. Now, since you're right-handed, Jonathan, I'm going to ask you to raise your left hand, put it behind you, put your hand behind your head. So now you've got the, the breast exposed there. You're going to yeah. use your right hand. You can use three middle fingers three middle of the fingers. hand around the nipple area first. Yeah. Just move the, the fingers around the whole of the areola, the brown circle around the nipple area. You're feeling for any lumps that haven't been there before. OK. And then expand the search to the various quarters, the different quarters of the breast. So yeah. inner, upper, okay. just, just feel around there and then go down to the, uh, that's it, to the bottom there, then across, and then up towards the top and then yeah. into the armpit. Ah. There we go. And then finally, just pinch the nipple with yep. a, a, a <laughs> thumb and forefinger, see if there's any oozing, okay. look for any rash. And really, that's as quick as it, it takes, really? you know? So you've he, done the check. Have you've you done ever done that, Jonathan? Is it you know, I, no. I didn't even know it existed. Yeah. And it's, that's, that's something everyone can do, right? Of course. And it's quick, yeah. it's quite the, the easy. It's quite easy. The we'll put the video of it on. Yeah, dressing. men who are more at risk have got f family history of okay. breast cancer or prostate or colon cancer. They may have higher estrogen levels okay. because of obesity or because of liver disease or they may have been treated for lymphoma. Sure. Those men are more at risk, but any man should just do a, a check. For on sure, a we know basis. it's rare, but it's good to, yeah. to check yourself Absolutely. out. Thank you, Jonathan.